Putting an end to a global nightmare is it really that easy? As the COVID-19 pandemic continues to wreak havoc, the world is asking, how close are we to a potential cure? The world wants to know, when shall we have a vaccine? Well, the answer is indefinite, but medical research has given us potential clues and hope in the direction. What is a vaccine? A vaccine is a biological preparation that provides active acquired immunity against any infectious disease. It typically contains an agent that resembles a disease-causing microorganism and is often made from weakened or killed forms of microbe, toxins or one of the surface proteins. What are the hurdles then? Whenever we inject a foreign substance in the human body, it is bound to cause an immune response. But this response needs to be tamed and well-directed. Vaccine development is a multi-phase process. Each step requires stringent regulation and control. The product has to pass the clinical trials before it can be made available to human beings. This process takes 5 to 15 years approximately for completion stage to reach. But with COVID-19 being declared a pandemic by WHO and the death toll increasing every moment, every second, we cannot afford to wait so long. As doctors battle endlessly to save lives in hospitals worldwide, the scientific minds are racing to produce the first vaccine for the novel coronavirus. What is the current state of the vaccine? About 35 companies and institutions are racing to create a vaccine, while four candidates have been shortlisted. First is mRNA-1273 developed by Moderna Therapeutics and US NIH. Human trials started after unusually skipping any animal research. Jennifer Holler became the first human volunteer for the vaccine trial. The next candidate is being jointly developed by CanSino Biologics and the Academy of Military Medical Sciences, China. It is at its phase 1 trial stage and it is being tested on subjects in Wuhan, which was the epicentre of COVID-19. Other candidates are CureVac, BioNTech, Pfizer and Novavax. While Inovio Pharmaceuticals is repurposing the existing MERS vaccine, it has reached the phase 2 of human trials. Till the vaccine is ready, what are the alternate life-saving strategies? They include repurposing the existing drugs such as the antiviral drugs, anti-malarial drugs, combination of the HIV drugs and so on. Another interesting therapy is using the blood of the patients who recovered. This carries potent antibodies against the virus. The US FDA has allowed the use of this convalescent plasma to be used as an alternate therapy in case of emergency. Although not a certified treatment, it is an SOS method. Follow the preventive measures such as social distancing and self-isolation. Finally, use your brain and help break the pandemic chain. While the vaccine becomes commercially available, we need to be patient because we cannot afford to risk human lives any further. Thank you for watching. For more updates, please subscribe to BK.